Let me show you a couple of our gold trades today. We have Cobra Gold getting short 1192.50, covering at 1186.50, and we've got Gold Spike. I want to show you this, showing you how to trade two opposing positions in the same market, same contract. Uh, gold Spike got long at 1190.80, put a thousand dollar profit target on it, and so we're looking at August Gold and the first trade of the day. Um, and, and this is 1192.50. And then the second trade of the day is uh, Gold Spike got long before Cobra Gold got out. So Gold Spike got long at 1190.80. So you've got two trades here on. In reality, it looks like you got short at 1192.50, uh, exited at 1190.80, and then when Gold Cobra Gold took its profit target at 1186.50, it this strategy was flat, but your real world position was long. And that puts you in on gold spike, and then it got out at at 1200.80, and you see a huge short covering rally uh, in gold going into the weekend, last day of the quarter. Um, you've got a 30 point rally. Uh, I could anticipate, just speaking of gold, you see a losing trade yesterday in gold spike. Um, you get 30 points from 1190 to 1220, and you pull back here. You could get another 30 point move and move up to the 1240, uh, 1250 area potentially uh, in gold going into the weekend, going to close the month out. Uh, nothing goes straight up or straight down. Gold's volatile and it's gone fairly straight down uh, this week and the end of this month. And so there could be some short covering. I anticipate uh, another big rally as you can see here how that could happen but that's gold spike and cobra gold and how to trade two opposing positions in the trade station let me show you the settings for that format strategies and then you go properties for all and you go under automation and you set it up like this you need to check this you can trade multiple automated strategies or multiple charts using the same futures or forex symbol in the same account um, I cancel and replace my limit orders after three seconds. You need to do this in every chart with the same symbol. You'd have to go over here to the gold spike strategy and do the exact same thing. And there's your settings. And that's how you do it. You just set up the strategy, you do these settings, and then the uh, order that the orders come, um, you'll see you'll see the order. So real, real world position uh, when you have a short trade and a long trade is flat and then um, you're not in a position any longer until one of those positions gets out. Either at, if they both get stopped out, you can get whipsawed. In this case, this is a good scenario uh, because they both hit their profit targets in opposite directions, and so it worked out well. And so that's that's one of the main questions that I get a lot, and that's how you set it up.